Hello everyone, this is Lillian and it's time for our 3 minutes with the word audio devotional. Today's topic in our What's in a Name series is Yahweh Nisi part 10, Banner of Unity. And our anchor scripture is taken from the book of Exodus chapter 17 and verse 15. Moses built an altar and called it, the Lord is my banner. One thing about banners is that they are symbols of unity. Irrespective of the internal bickerings that go on in the United States of America, for instance, when the flag is hoisted, there is a sense of patriotism and loyalty and the nation becomes one under the flag. It is the same for most nations of the world. The people are united under one banner. Yahweh Nisi is our banner of unity. As members of the body of Christ, we are one under Christ. This demon of denomination and sectarianism that has crept into the church should be resisted with all that is in us. There is a level of power that the church is yet to see because she is divided. This my church is superior to your syndrome is a tragic ploy from the pit of hell to reduce the power in the body of Christ. Oh my dear listeners, we are one under the banner of Yahweh Nisi. We are one under the banner of Christ. I pray for the day when people can walk into any center of worship and lift holy hands to the Lord. I pray for the day when church leaders will stop pushing selfish ambition and agenda and lift up only God's agenda for these last days. I pray for an end of suspicion and hate and disunity within the body of Christ. We are one under the Lord's banner. We are one body. We have one faith and we are joined together in love. Just last weekend, I walked into a church, a different church from my own, and they had a worship service. My dear listeners, the presence and the power of God in that place was beautiful. There was unity. No one cared where I came from. I definitely didn't care where anyone came from. And it was heavenly. There was love. There was God. There was unity. We are united under the same banner. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you for your word. Lord, I just pray. That the church will be one. I pray God for love. Let your love be shared abroad in our hearts, in our churches, in our groups. Lord, let your love, let your love reign, O God. And let your church be one. In the name of Jesus. Continue to take all the glory, almighty God. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Speak to you again soon. If you are blessed, please drop me a line on audiodevotional at yahoo.com or on our website at www.3minutesaudiodevotional.com. Remember, wrapped up in God's word is all you need for your change to come. Love you and bye.